Hello everyone, my name is Butter Togsley, and this is Hijaxed, Miss Tish, and Cronin. Hello. Cronin, you sound drained. Yes. Well, don't be anymore. Okay. Good. And do you want me to click on the boat, or do you want to? Well, everyone else say hi. I did. Hi. <laughs> For some reason, it's not detecting you, and now it's... I was going to say, yeah, Discord is not even... I didn't even hear Jax. I didn't hear you. <laughs> yeah. Cronin's the only one that responded. <clears throat> so... Can uh, you hear me now? Yes. Yeah, we hear you now. It's just before I couldn't. Uh, so in the last video, uh, we took care of some more stuff. We uh, helped out the Sovereign, uh, giving him the information, and he rewarded us. And we were also going to help out uh, Mr. Uh, well, his body is gone now, but uh, yeah, we helped out that guy, uh, that mushroom guy. He wanted to have us kill uh, the other Sovereign just so he can reign just because of his anger and jealousy towards the other one not helping him and now we're going to take the underdark draugr boat and we're going to head to the other side of the lake to continue our adventures to take care of the draugrs at the mines so miss begin the boat board the raft Do I get it? see what happens hey it shows all of us waters. sail into the darkness Sailing takes me away. Oh, we get to see what a Draugr boat works like. Okay. Interesting sail design. Hmm. I guess it works. I mean, it's moving. Doesn't move super fast, but I mean, we're underground, so I'm not expecting heavy winds. Uh, oh, wow, this lake is bigger than I thought. Uh. Uh. Uh oh. Hi! Don't mind us. Just don't. You! Where's Gek? Who are you? <laughs> we can choose to push him in the water. <laughs> he gets like six things from strength and everything. Oh God! What do we do? Reach out in uh, to the Draugr's. Wait, he has a parasite. Uh, I say the parasite. See, the sergeant, I believe, she's keen to get these boots back. Yeah, that's the boots that uh, the gnome Your took. Your parasite stares briefly, then goes still. The Dwegar is not infected. Ah. Uh, okay. Uh. <laughs> they Come on, guys. Okay. I mean, we're already going to fight the Draugr, so we're not going to give them back their boots. I mean, we're making use of the boots. <laughs> I think that's this one less stronger. Mm -hmm. Yep, uh, that's one less stronger to deal with. <laughs> my God. Oh, oh the fantastic. puntables. Well, it's time for me to uh, begin my fuckery. You only have five to deal with. That's it. One, two, three, yeah, five. That's it. Fly. And now I hit you in the eyes with my beak. Ha! You're blind, bitch! My god, you blinded him. Yes, well, and. I, well, well, miss, you jumped. I, I was about to throw the bomb on the ship and see what it did. Whee! Sorry. I can't jump back. It's alright. We have a, we have advantage of one of the uh, archers being blind now. Uh, Cronin and Jax, work with my raven. Go for the archers that are blinded. I blind the one at the far front. Ready. Yeah, miss, go! <laughs> Holy shit. Miss is fucking rocking it over there. 
I gotta end turn now, though. Yep, go ahead. Uh, we'll be giving you assistance as best as we can. Oh. You asshole. Well, at least the object missed, but the, the effect afterwards hit. I got the guy in front of me if you guys want to take care of the rest or start to take care of the rest. Yeah, that's uh, that's why I'm having uh, everyone help out with by taking care of the archers because they're going to be a problem. Uh, actually, I think there's only one archer. There's no, there's two. two. Jairus. Uh, okay, I was thinking of Mind Master Kettle, but nah, he's like dressed like a rogue guy. So they got like a rogue person. Uh, My question is, how long is this damn stream of water? Well, very long by the looks of it. I am going to hit... Let's see, do I want to hit... Jairus' turn is until after Cronin, so I'm going to do something... You guys want me to... Pr well, actually, no, the... The highest you chance of person make, I can... Hmm? You make Kettle, my, my Master Kettle laugh. Uh, I can try, but his percentage Alchemist chance... Argrim. Who Who's the rapid clicking? What's going on? That is me. Are you okay? Yes. Okay. Um... Uh, Mind Master Kettle has a 40%, whereas all the others have a 55% chance. So I might not hit him, but Do I can try. Do it on Alchemist Argrim, because he'll try and attack the boat. Uh, at the very front. He is a 40% also. Uh, maybe it's because of my range? Let me try moving closer. Need to find a way forward. Alright, let's see if it's increased. I'm here. Nope, still 40%. So I can try, it just might miss, so let's hope it does. Nope. He saved. Alright. Uh I am going to do uh no. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do this. Whoop. Yay. They both missed, Jax. You're good. He shrunk himself! Why does the shitling want to become even shittier? Yeah. Uh, uh, that's a good question. Actually, if I recall in Dungeons and Dragons, if you shrink yourself, you get, I believe, Ooh. farther movement and you become Ooh. harder to hit. Can I? Can I? You can hit. If you hit Jairus, you could probably knock him right off the boat. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, I'm gonna try. Come on. Go for hit, it. Hit, hit. Yes! Yeah! He's gone. Jairus fell to their death. Nice shot. Yippee. Wonderful shot. Very good, Cronin. The one time it actually hits. I'm gonna go over to Herc and hit him. Uh, alright. I am gonna fly to Kettle. And I am going to peck him in the eyes. Damn it. Herc is at four. Such close health. Uh, Jax, do you, uh... What the hell? Oh, good. No, never mind. I thought you could do an attack. No, but I tried something. That asshole. He's back in visibility. Well, at least he's visible now. All right, I'm gonna try and help take care of Mr. Short Man. I can't, I can't keep using too much stuff that's not cantrips though. I need to start using cantrips more. There we go. That did something. <clears throat> I'm gonna use my necklace and I'm gonna use this on you. Thank you. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna move a little bit more forward now. These boots have seen everything. Ooh! Hellish rebuke him! He's dead. What the fuck? I'm dead. <gasps> he killed my bird! 
He pushed my bird off the edge. <laughs> What's sad is we're not going to get loot, but I don't think it, we're going to give the chance to get loot. Be right there. There you go, Jax. Thank you. Yee. Yeah. Hey, there we go. Oh, so we can get a, cho uh, a chance to get loot. Got an inspiration point. Uh, I'm going to jump over there and... Oh, I... Oh, wait. Yeah, no, I can't reach over there. My jump is not strong enough. The craft is ready to sail. Continue. Hopefully, we are able to do a fight when it comes. We should be able to. It's why I'm trying my best not to use too many spells. Like, because that's the upside of the cantrips. It's supposed to be... I have no spells left. Well, I mean... You do have a melee weapon that you can use more often for damage. And you also have the crossbow. True. Oh. Oh. My, on my end, everything's loading. Oh, there we go. I'll admit, this is actually a pretty nice decor place. I liked how everything worked. That's ominous. Whoa. That's a drow gate. Ah. Uh. Well, okay, I guess we're going with this. That's so. I You feel the slightest of stirrings in your head. The Dwegar is not infected, yet your minds resonate. I'll be. You ain't shitting. Felt the tingle. In that case, let's talk business. Your twat's old friend Nair caused a rockfall, trapped tighter than a hornet's arse. Couple of known slaves stuck with him, too. Little bastards. You absolute shaggers owe us a crap load of coin. You want through? Make a donation. Ha <laughs> ha! I don't want to give them coin. We're scrounging for coins now. Okay, yep. Uh, they want that. I'll go Unclog for Unclog your hole. Just shitting around. But I'm warning you. That twat soul ain't settled up soon. There'll be hell to pay for the lot of you cult buggers. Asshole. Let's go. Cronin might really love this place because this has a lot of drow decor. Mm. Oh, and there's the thing. This is the Grim Forge. Okay. Well, I go straight ahead. Fort like this doing in the underdark. Oh, they have a cellar. I'm gonna see the cellar after. Uh, I'm gonna. The video. I'm gonna see what he has. I'm just curious. Well, I mean, we're gonna keep going. What's a fort like this doing Talking in the underdark? Him. Or trying to at least. The hell's that sound? Oh, they got a bunch of spiders. A bunch of spiders down there, like. Uh, y'all, I'm stuck. What do you mean you're stuck? What? Yeah, I literally can't do anything. How peculiar. Smooth face. Cobbled edges. They're a sign. They must be. A sun dweller in these parts. Look here, my topside friend. I need fresh eyes. And I doubt I'll find fresher. Uh, as rare as a smile in Shindlerin, you might say. But I've no skill for slaving. I prefer... <laughs> oh. 
crap. There we go. But these learned eyes reach their limits. And so I must humbly request yours. I accidentally clicked out of the game for a second there, but that's okay. Didn't miss much. The rock, the rubble, all of it, if I may be so bold. Take a look. Tell me what you see. And be thorough. Uh, yeah, I would say use history. Good luck. Yeah. Can't give you bardic inspiration, so this is all you. Twelve. Thirteen. Ooh. Nice. The statue's meandering curves and golden edges stand out against the weathered masonry behind it. Two styles, two eras. The statue was carved from newer stone and erected by latecomers to this ancient fortress. Anything standing out? Uh, I guess you could do the other ones if you want. What? <coughs> ah, I failed. Me. Wonder if I can roll again. Uh, oh, I can roll again. Cool. Hey. That 20. Nice. Boulders and stone bricks. Of I well, a dirty 20. The Nat 20 would mean Many you land on a 20. Oh, you would have got a 21 because of your plus Yet one. So it's a dirty 20. Fully intact. No quake brought these rocks down. They were smashed through in an instant. Something big charged through here. Something very big. I don't like the sound uh, of that. What do you think? All that's left the is perception one next. All that's left is perception. Besides the observation. Hey, there you go. All three. Several glassy stones stand out in the debris. Their borders are coated with tiny yellow crystals. Hmm. The hottest of flames smoothed the stone and left sulfuric crystals behind. The fires of the hells have touched Grimforge. Something tells me this place got busted in by demons. I got a feeling you're right. Incredible. An entire history risen from dirt and debris. Picture it. An ancient city hewn from the stone by disciples of Shah. Later abandoned. Untold centuries later, a new tribe revives it. Fresh walls, fresh sculptures, until a great hell beast charges through, toppling the walls and crushing the people. Ah, that explains the infernal plate I found. Perhaps you might have use of it. I did pick up hellish iron before. But my work has only begun. There is more still to find. I must get to it. Well, let's see what you've got. Let's see what he has. We'll end off oh, the video wow. here, because our friend has to go. So, we are here at Grimforge, and we're about to see what else lies ahead of us here and take care of these Draugars however we see fit. With that being said, Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and ding the bell so that you guys can stay notified of the content that uploads onto the channel and to help support us. And as always, we'll see you all in the next video. Take care. Have a wonderful sleep and healthy day. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.